star stable. First time I've ever actually been able to. What did I hit? Actually been able to record this. As you can see, I got the uh, fancy graphics and the shading. And I'm lagging. Only place it's not laggy so far is in my home stable. Yep, yep, no, it's laggy in here now too. Got Star Guardian. Thunder King, which is going to be upgraded to new Frisians very soon. Strawberry Angel. Autumn Star, which I'm going to change her name to... Probably down here somewhere. Too many post it notes. I think it was like autumn wind or something. Something autumn, definitely something autumn. And she was gonna become this is Onyx Star. I was gonna name her Onyx Lady, I think. So we sound like an idiot. And you're probably wondering where my starter horse is. He's in the pasture, kind of retired. But this is Morning Star. The name is not gonna change. Didn't mean to click that. And now you're probably gonna wanna see the my stable. So the door is open just a weird amount. You can sit down at this table. I don't know why they put that there. And you can get more water here. Some weird thing close the door. You can't even you can't even get through unless you open it. <laughs> I got attention to detail. 
This is where all your stable care and such is. Here's your storage. If you wanted to get water here, you could. Otherwise, this, this room has no real purpose. Over here. Okay, so we got one more stall here. One more three stalls. Then there's two stalls right over here. Honestly, I, I would have moved these rooms down and put the stalls closer to the other ones, but okay. In here is, I believe, the feed room. Pretty empty, absolutely nothing to do here. Random pitchfork. And in here is the tack room. A shovel and a wheelbarrow. Absolutely nothing else of reason. I wish to let you hang up your actual saddles, bridles, and blankets here. And you could, like, store actual hay in the feed room. And this is your second exit. I think it's a really good idea that they turned off shading in here, because, yikes, there's going to be a disaster waiting to happen. And I've tried. You can open this mounted, but you can't ride in here. So I figured, okay, yeah, you can't ride in there, okay. So I got off and tried to lead my horse in, but that didn't work either. Let me just fix that, because I just goofed up so much. See? He also gives us a little rear of, I can't go in here. If you go far enough in here. You can, however, I'm pretty sure, ride in to the wash station. But again, there's like, no reason to be in here. You can't even do a little trick. Overall, this is really nice. I mean, probably need to like put a little divot in the floor here. So logically, the laundry would go in that drain, but looks fine. The main, the main just needs to stop glowing. No one has put LED lights into it. That's my review of the home stable. And this is the upgrade man. He's gonna say he's real bored. And this is your first upgrade. I assume they're just gonna make this part longer and longer and longer and longer, longer. You can... Honestly, what are you gonna do with more than 12 horses? Stare at them? I prefer my equines be a bit more useful. Or at least ones I use, right?
I feel something else in here. Don't ask me why I'm throwing around a cursed necklace. I, I just feel like it. Maybe the same reason I have rainbow gold, a good heart, a glorious star stone, and an empty bag once filled with magical powder in my bank, a bunch of archaeology junk. I'm, I'm basically, right now, I'm just armed. Got this in case, you know, shadow seekers. So yeah, I should probably put that in here. I really don't need to be cursed. My rune wand. A bus pass. A pickaxe. That, that's actually for fighting. This is for blinding people. That is to make me lucky. Luck, luck is the thing you need in this game. That's my video. Let me know if you want to see more of this.